Spanish relationship. What do you mean? You enjoy being with her? Yeah. You find her attractive? Yeah. And you're not sleeping with her? No. You're afraid to let yourself be happy. Why can't you give me credit for this? This is a big thing for me. I never had a relationship with a woman that didn't involve sex. I should call her? Yeah. Why should I call her? Because she likes you. She told me she did. You're crazy. No, I'm not. She said she finds you attractive. She says you found me attractive? No, look, I'm being serious. I've had a few minor fiascos in my own love life, and I admit that freely. Freddy, you took a date to one of your own weddings. I'm a, I'm a free spirit. I'm extremely liberal. I'm a freewheeling dude. You know what your problem is? You're in love with this girl, and you're trying to convince yourself you're not. I can't ref the next games, by the way. I gotta go meet gynecologists with Allison. She doesn't like her gynecologist. You think she likes you? She's trying to. Yeah. She's entertaining the idea. Exactly. Of you. I'll take that. We're in one of those phases where everything that the other person says just annoys the shit out of each other mm. all the time. Mm -hmm. It's a blast. Don't worry about it. You just gotta write that out. She just canceled on you? She was about to, and she got interrupted by her boss. My stuff. You know what? Who needs her whole fancy presentation and her board of directors? I make an honest living and I pay my taxes most of the time. I'll tell you something, Dom, I agree with you. I'm an American too, and I agree with your plight, brother. Let it ride! So I did a lot of thinking last night. There's something I'm pretty excited about. What's up? Nice. Let it Well, I feel like I might be ready to move on. You know, get my life back on track. So, I'm going to ask Polly Prince on a date. Oh, that's a mistake. She's not right for you, dude. Rain dance! Single? I don't think that's not an issue. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, are you seriously telling me that if you don't find a nice Jewish girl and settle down in the next six months, they're not gonna give you this job? You know what she's saying to me, Ryan? She's saying I have an addiction. Really? Well, you work 90 hours a week. You know, that's, I guess that addiction's more socially acceptable, you know? Am I wrong? Am I wrong? No, well, nobody's really wrong in these situations. I mean, you have wants and needs, she likewise. Do you want to be with her, but she thinks you have a son, and you don't? I mean, like, if you're going to be with someone, shouldn't you tell them things like that? No. How are things with you and Angela? Oh, we're cool, man, you know. <clears throat> well, we went out a couple times, man, and she was getting so involved that I said, look, I'm just going to pull back. Mm. Cool. The woman is driving me crazy. Which woman? Uh, Andy or Princess Sophia? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait a second. I thought you said after the next game that she was a goddess. Oh, she was. That was the good Andy, guys. This amazing, fun, cool, sexy woman. All right, I'm talking about the evil Andy now. She's got to go. You're dumping Paula? What happened? Same thing that always happens. Everything is going along nice and smooth. We're having a good time. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, whoop, she gets serious. You're doing it again. What? The thing where the woman gets close and you, and you pull the relationship whipcord. Guys, it's simple. The fun's gone. Thanks for taking me out here. Uh, this is the first time I've felt good in three weeks or so. You need to get back on that board is what you need to do. Yeah. Hey, here's the deal. When life gives you lemons, just say fuck the lemons and fail. You notice I didn't mention her once today. I didn't want to say anything. Oh, yeah, why? Oh, it's kind of like not talking to your pitcher in the middle of a no-hitter. I don't talk about it that much. <laughs> I, I didn't mention her once today. Ten to ten. The only reason I mentioned her at all was to tell you I'm not going to talk about her anymore. I thought you'd appreciate I that. I do. I do. Good for you, Mikey. It's just like most of the time you go to bed with someone, and then she tells you all her stories, you tell all your stories. Well, with Sally and me, we'd already heard each other's stories. So once we went to bed, we didn't know what we were supposed to do, you know? Sure, Harry. Looks like our buddy Joel here is finally getting ready to pop the question. Pretty great, right? Hey, don't ask me. I can hardly commit to a second date half the time. Oh. If you know what I mean. Oh. Watch out! <laughs> Do not listen to Mr. Chronically Single, always dating some new hot chick guy. Being married is great. That's the point of view I represent. Deb and I have been married for eight years, and it's better now than when we first met. You know what? You guys make a lot of sense. I'm gonna go propose. Let's toss the ball around. Okay. 
Got to tell you about something. Shoot, Danny. It's about Lisa. Go on. She's beautiful. She looks great in a red dress. I think I'm in love with her. <laughs>